You don't forgive someone because they deserve it. It's a gift. You gotta decide what you want the legacy of this ranch to be. Are you in? I'm in. Beauty may not have been bred to compete, but she was born to do this. From the beloved 1877 novel to over a dozen movies and TV shows over the course of a century, the story of a horse named Black Beauty has captured hearts for generations. Now, the new TV series Beyond Black Beauty brings this timeless tale into the present with the story of family, heritage, and one spirited horse. We're excited to meet series creator, executive producer, and showrunner. We have Pilar Golden, as well as the star of the series, we have Kaya Coleman. Welcome to the show, ladies. Thanks for joining us today. Thanks for having us. Yeah, Pilar, uh, I wanted to start off with you. What inspired the idea to bring the classic story of Black Beauty into a more modern setting? Amazon was really excited about bringing the IP to the 21st century. And so I was as well, because it's sort of like, well, how do you make Black Beauty for 2024? And as a Black woman who didn't know Black cowboys existed, I felt really compelled to bring this subset of the Black community to the screen. And I think you've done so well. I mean, just watching the trailer, it already has captivated me, my colleagues. So we're really excited to see this. And Kaya, you play the lead character, Jolie. In the series, your character moves from Belgium all the way to Baltimore. Talk about that big leap for Jolie and how Black Beauty comes into play to help her cope with such a big move. Yes, I mean, when you are moving geographical locations, <laughs> you're also moving emotionally. And I think that um, there's a really big loss and there's a feeling of loss as she goes through this move and working through that grief and working through that anger is um, something that I, I got to explore through Jolie. And of course, meeting, a, meeting a, a, a spirited horse that you can connect to, I think Jolie felt really seen. And through that relationship, she really learns about her heritage, about legacy and the power of family and forgiveness. How does the series reflect the realities of today's audience? I think, you know, mostly it's, reflective of how complex you know families can be um this is a family that deals with grief deals with repression um but also manages to grow together and so i think especially post pandemic life most families can identify with this one um in the way that they move through their pain and kaya i have to point out there's a role you say there's a line you say in the trailer that caught my attention where you say, I am not your diversity doll on a pamphlet. Could you explain a little bit what that means to this show and saying something like that? Black experience mm -hmm. is not a monolith. It is extremely dynamic. This character is not one dimensional. And especially I can relate to being a, a biracial um, former athlete and like being, being the diversity doll and people wanting to just be able to say, this is enough. And it's like, it's not enough. We need more representation. We need to visually see, see it. And I think when you asked, you know, about what reflecting uh, the current, the current state, it's like, there are young black equestrians who are out there and they're pursuing their dreams and they're doing a great job and i think that it's i hope that people get curious of like how can we bridge this world between english equestrian and western and how can we how can we bridge those two worlds and i think the show does a really good job of doing that you have me more and more excited just to watch it polar what are some of the themes in beyond black beauty that you hope will resonate with viewers especially those who love the original story um the relationship between mother and daughter black women are are definitely at the forefront of this show, so Black women should feel seen. Um, and as Kaya was saying, you know, one of the important pieces of the show is highlighting just how accessible the horse world is to a Black community. Even though it's a largely white space, we are seeing Black equestrians, we are now seeing Black cowboys in the zeitgeist, and so we're, the hope is to continue to push the conversation forward. Well, I appreciate both of your time, Pilar and Kaya. I can't wait for our viewers to check out this show. The new series, Beyond Black Beauty, premieres Tuesday, October 15th on Prime Video.